Today's video and the NewLog line of sensors are brought to you by ISCO Scientific. NewLog sensors are a laboratory data collection system which utilize plug and play technology to cut down on setup time and maximize the time spent learning. Today we're going to conduct an exothermic reaction using only common household items to heat this container up by about 10 degrees Celsius. I really like this experiment because you can use it to teach chemistry to students of all ages. For younger students, you can just have them feel the warmth of the container. For older students, you can have them determine the chemical reaction, the, the equations, or alter the amount of materials to find out how that correlates to the final temperature. All you need for this experiment is some vinegar, some steel wool, and two containers. Before we begin collecting data, we must first configure the new log software for our experiment. Once your temperature sensor has been detected, click Online Experiment, Experiment Setup, Set the duration to 10 minutes, the rate to 10 per second, and ensure that your temperature sensor is in Celsius. First, we place the steel wool in one of the containers, fully submerge it in vinegar, and leave it to sit for about one minute. After the steel's been soaking in the vinegar for about one minute, we're going to take it, wring it out, and quickly transfer it to the second container and seal the lid. Then we can watch our temperature rise using the new log software. Here we see the temperature rising in real time as the steel wool reacts with oxygen to produce energy. The reaction we just did was the oxidation of iron, or the formation of rust. When we soaked the steel wool in vinegar, we were actually removing the steel's protective layer leaving exposed iron. When we transferred the steel wool into the second container, it began reacting with oxygen and water vapor to form iron oxide, which is rust. We see that the temperature of the air in the container increased by 14.5 degrees Celsius over the course of 10 minutes. For more information on new log sensors, please go to our website at newlog.com. Thanks for watching.